I've got this boat outside the water for two weeks now. We pulled it out during the last storm warning, but it's a very, very heavy boat and I don't have a trailer. Now we're gonna put it back in the water. We have a truck coming to push it. We have a few wood rollers. Every time I have to put this boat back in the water, it's a lot of stress. You never know what can happen. The boat can tip over, something can break. So hopefully everything's gonna go fine. Let's see how it goes. that part. Oh, it's a bad idea. Oh, it's working. Careful the boat, don't stay under the boat. Hey, go, go for it. Yeah, careful your fingers, don't you? crazy the boat is finally back in the water boat launch in the caribbean are always crazy we found a few guys that came over and helped in exchange of a little bit of rum punch definitely not easy to get that boat back in the water it's a very very heavy boat but it worked out we got it in it's back on its mooring now we can go explore the island with it Now that the big speedboat is back in the water, um, you need to test the engine. Uh, it's always like this with boats. Uh, you store them for a while, you need to make sure everything works fine after you put it back in the water. Today is a perfect day to go Tobago Keys again. Tobago Keys is my favorite place in the world. Uh, perfect blue water, amazing crystal clear. So we'll take some kites and hydrofoil and go for a little foil session in the Tobago Keys. <laughs> We're now on the boat heading for Tobago Keys. Ziwa is going to be our boat captain for today and he's going to help me film and get some shot of the Tobago Keys. Should be fun, see you in a bit. but every single time I come to the Tobago Keys, I'm amazed like it is the first time. Have you ever seen water so clear in your life? I mean, it's even more blue than any swimming pool I can think of. There are many different islands make the Tobago Keys. We have Baradal where we can swim with the turtles and then there is James P where we're gonna launch the kite from. Um, the wind is very light, but we're still gonna give it a try. It's totally worth it to foil in such a beautiful spot. And right over there, this is the island Petit Tabac. This is the island where they filmed the movie Pirates of the Caribbean. In the first movie, where they burn coconut trees on the beach, this is where they did it. We finally made it to James B, one of the most beautiful islands where we can launch the kite in the Tobago Keys. As we arrived to James B, the island where we launched the kite from, um, we were focusing on the reef with the boat. The drone was actually flying around to film our arrival to the island and I heard a very strange noise which sounded exactly like propellers inside a coconut tree branch and that's exactly what happened. We crashed the drone. So I hope it still works because we got a lot to film today. Woo, we made it! If you ever dreamed of a paradise island, this is it.
there is absolutely no wind on this beach so it's going to be very tricky to launch a kite um, first thing first we need to try the drone see if it still flies then i'm going to power launch my kite on the beach fingers crossed put the launch These things are indestructible. Have a fun day in paradise. Uh, Tobago Keys is definitely a good spot. Uh, it's a little bit choppy, so it's not too good for freestyle. But once you have a foil, it's amazing. You can just go explore all the islands around, see the turtle. A great afternoon. You know you've made it to the Tobago Keys when the fishes are really hungry and they come very close to you. Look at this. I'm gonna throw this little piece of bread. Get ready. One, two, three. One last thing before we go. Let me share with you my favorite view in the entire world. It's right up there. This trail is full of iguanas, this big lizard that live on the island. They love soaking up the sun. Look, there's one right here. This is what I meant when I said the best view you have ever seen. Look at this. All right, guys, I really hope you enjoyed this episode of Island Life. Don't forget to subscribe to the channel and like the video if you enjoyed it. See you next time. Yeah man, this is Island Life. If you enjoy watching, like the video. If you want to learn about the Island Life, don't forget to subscribe. Man, see you on the next video.